play. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, so now we finally going to get to the Beowulf video. I finally got my ammo in yesterday. And we got a bunch of targets here. We got my good friend, my only friend in the world, Mr. Hawk, Mike. And, Keep the heads ringing. and we're going to get into it. And we got some plaster, some paint, some water, uh, some pudding, some pork and beans, some books, some Fago, and some bones. Chronograph to shoot. Yep, chronograph here. Might have an accent. 460 Magnum. Because yeah, them sites are just, we just randomly put them on there. So, yeah. And this mag I got, I got this mag years ago. I never used it, but it actually says 458 and 50 Beowulf on there. And the end of it's kind of like, they don't have that little divider in there for 223. It's more open for the bigger bullets. The, the upper, I didn't even cl didn't clean it at all or lube or nothing. Box straight onto there. So we're going to get set up here and we'll try we'll probably try to hollow points on want to make a mess first or last yeah, yeah yeah we'll make the mess first that way everything else is just sticky all the time so yeah we'll do that let's get set up here okay we're gonna try we got five rounds in here of just some flat nose round nose chambered okay we, uh, let's see if i can hit that stuff yeah that feels good <laughs> open work good it's loud man that is loud <laughs> you can feel it all the way back here it's a lot of fun man that's for sure what's yeah. the recoil like probably like a 12 gauge okay yeah it, it, there's some recoil there like if this was full auto or full semi you would you would definitely know it <laughs> <laughs> all right. I think we're both gonna get fucking soaked here i think you're gonna get it worse i think you're gonna feel the blast you ready yep What a mess. <laughs> yeah. Shocker, huh? <laughs> All right, so now we got another 275 grain hollow point here. Got some pork and beans up there. It's shooting a little bit low. So we were at point blank range. You ready, Mike? Yeah. I got beans, dude. dude. <laughs> I got beans in the eye so fucking hard, man. You got some on the rifle too. Yeah, there's beans. Beans everywhere. <laughs> Look how far it blew the can back too. <laughs> oh man, like I'm literally gonna have a black eye from a bean on that. <laughs> Look at my buddy Mike Hawk here. <laughs> He's gonna be shooting a 375 grain at some water because I just got beaned in the eye so fucking hard. Like it definitely broke the skin because it hurts, man. So he's gonna take over and I'm gonna shoot some water. Ready? Yes, sir. That thing sounds like a grenade going it off. It does, don't it? <laughs> all right. Yeah, you got a good shot on that, man. Dude, Mike's on it today. Mike Hawk, he's always, he, he got them hawk eyes, dude. Did we? <laughs> He kept Bunch center here. They want to see that one too, man. deviating. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, it came out the back. It looks like or cracked it. That's pretty impressive. Most guns don't go through that much water, especially that straight. Because there's another water jug down there. Right there. Yeah. Dude, my cock, dude. He's on it. Yeah, it broke the handle and everything here. <laughs> so that's pretty impressive. Was that five five jugs of water? Yeah. and devastated that, so, that with a hollow point yeah with a hollow point so so far i'm pretty impressed how about you i'm impressed. I, I want one now yeah i do that's something i paid like 250 bucks for that upper the ammo was 220 dollars, but still for it's running good so far so we'll try some more stuff here <laughs> yeah i'm good <laughs> <laughs> okay mike far. hawk decided to go with extreme penetrator because mike hawk penetrates everything deep deep penetration we got eight cans of cotton candy fago my inner fat kid is crying i know me too ray when you are brother uh, I... i'm blocking my eyes yeah block your eyes all 
dude. I wanted one of those. A piece, a piece of can <laughs> went ripping right past Gunzo. us. <laughs> dude, that guy, that's powerful, that man. Fun. Like, yeah, he was gonna chug one, but there's, dude, look at the, look at that. That was extreme penetrator too, man. That's a fucking impressive, man. That is. Wow. I don't even know where the rest of the was. <laughs> I think a piece went ripping past us. <laughs> yeah, there. Yeah, so far, Some man. Over there. <laughs> yeah, so far. Ah, uh, well, we definitely have backup for the spray paint. I know that. Yeah. So let's go, maybe spray foam or something. Yeah. What do we? What do you say? These ones. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna go with the 375 grain hollow point, and we're not even really using ear protection because this gun isn't that bad. It uh. Sounds like your grenade going off. It's Sounds like, like an M80. Yeah, it's not ear piercing. Yeah. Just uh, when the beans come flying back, that's the most that's what it hurts. fucking thing. Okay. <laughs> what a hell of a money shot. Dude. <laughs> Dude. Dude. Oh. All over the ammo, all over me, the gun. This oh. is turned into this. Why is it you? <laughs> Look, dude, I got facial the fuck. <laughs> Gay! Dude, my cock, dude. He should have been shooting this. I should have. My cock just fired all over the place. <laughs> so we just busted the biggest load anybody ever has ever. There is in the whole bucket, <laughs> the whole bucket of plaster. The whole thing is completely gone. It blew the can of beans back there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did it hit the can of beans? <laughs> no, I think it did. It looks like it did. Yeah, on yeah, the side there. there. So they went through that whole can of plaster, through that can, kept on going. There's plaster all the way back there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there is. Here's the back of the bucket. Chronographs oh, covered in it. I got annihilated. I was sitting right there. This is uh, horrendous. This I got it in my hair, everywhere. Yep. It's starting to smell like a job site with fucking beans and <laughs> yeah. so let's take a break from the mess <laughs> we'll check a chronograph reading and then we'll do some books and then at the end i just stepped in yep and at the end we got that concrete i don't know we'll figure something out here it's getting out of control quickly behind me. Uh, yeah <laughs> all right so now we're just going to try a simple test here it's a chrono. I forget. These are 350 grain. I think they're going 1776, which is awesome. That's awesome. 1775, 1776. I don't know what barrel it's out. Probably a 16 inch, but this is an 18 inch barrel. So let's just see what happens. 1838. That's I have pretty an good, man. Barrel. I figure that's a 350 grain bullet, too. So we're just looking at that massive hole. Back here in the earth. <laughs> yeah, no, he, he can literally see it right beside that tree, man. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> so now we are going to try, try, we're going to try an extreme paint trader. I'm going to try this one that has caulk on it because there is caulk everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> this is terrible, man. All right. So we're going to see what extreme penetrator does. <clears throat> Sorry, Mr. Beck. Or am I? You ready? Yep. Damn. Did I hit him in the face? I was aiming for the face. I think he hit him in the throat. I think so. Hit a little low. A little left again. Yeah. Let's go see. Ah, oh, yeah. Low left. Yep. But, oh, dude, she kept going, man. She kept going through here. Stopped in this one. Stopped in that one. So that's one, two, one, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven. There she is. Wow. That's intact. Yeah. Could reload that. You could, yeah. You could. Huh. I'd save that. That's oh. all right. So now we're gonna put in dude. There is just <laughs> shit everywhere. This is a 275 grain hollow point, badass hollow point. And we'll see what it does to the books. See if I can get him in the face this time. In the face. You ready? Yep. Oh, you got hit the groin with the brass. <laughs> I heard that. Oh. Was that the, your nuts making that ting? Or yeah, that? it was a brass. <sighs> oh, man. You can tell even after the first one. Uh, man, she expanded. 597. Two, three, oh, black magic. four, five. That's pretty impressive. Six. They're sticking oh, wow. together. Six. 
seven. So, uh, I think that was it. No, right there it is. Yeah, might be eight. That's pretty impressive. Oh, wow. It like folded in. It didn't fold out. Yeah. It has to be, yeah, it's hot. Not so going fast enough, I guess. That is weird. That was with a really fat hollow point, right? Yeah, yep, yep. Huh. Because they have a, the hollow points are solid copper down here. But I'm surprised that didn't open up, man. Maybe. <laughs> yep. Recording. Oh, that was not easy. That was a good shot, though, man. Ah! Uh, <laughs> a little too right, but little that was bit. good. So, that was the books. I mean, that was almost right. There. Almost. <laughs> he got going back. Cap down through here, through here, through here. It tumbled. Yeah, it did. It yep. stopped in there, then. Yep, looks like it. Right. She kept oh, tumbling, man. Yeah, maybe. No, it. Yeah. Dang. Even sideways. Look how powerful it is going sideways. Holy shit. Look, it went through another one. It's. And another. <laughs> oh, my. Another one. Oh my god, this one's cracked right, back here. Here's part of it. Yeah, it kept just going. Blow, it just blowed apart. It went through all the books. Like, oh. damn. Yeah, I must have deviated, flew somewhere. So, what do you think? I think it's pretty fucking impressive, man. It really is. Like, it went through all them books and just the power that it still has. I was surprised. Like, I shoot 500 mags and stuff all the time. And I mean, mine's a short barrel. That's an 18 inch barrel, but. For semi-auto, like, it's pretty badass. I kind of want to try it in coyotes and stuff. Oh, that would be awesome. Yeah. Do two of each. Two of each? So we're going to do two of each here. So it's going to be 19 rounds. <laughs> <laughs> now, so we're going to load up, like, eight, whatever, two of each. Maybe mix them up, too. We'll see how it cycles. Okay. And then uh, there's an old dead tree here. If it ain't dead, it will be dead. <laughs> we'll see if we can take <laughs> it out. <laughs> and, yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, so that's my purse. Hello, do you? <laughs> you got teeth. Hey, ran them all though. It did, honestly. <laughs> yeah, that, that tree's dead now. That gets hard to control after a bit. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you fucked this. It's fucking done, dude. <laughs> That thing is oh. done. It almost fell over. You probably could push that fucker over. <laughs> for another hundred dollars, you could cut this tree down. <laughs> <laughs> Price of gas for a chainsaw. It breaks even. Yep. I'm gonna try to hit this paint. Let's try that again. Oh! There you go. There's just shrapnel and shit everywhere. <laughs> yeah. They're falling out of the trees. <laughs> they said it smells like a job site now. It does. Look how much you moved the wood over. Yeah, it did. You gonna check it out? Yeah. I mean, it's not like there's much to see. Yeah. They just moved the foam. It's breathing. It's breathing. <laughs> <laughs> that is a good shot, maybe. Oh, uh, right center. Look, look at all the gold paint. That is pretty. <laughs> Damn. Yep. Yeah. There's a can. That's the red can. Yeah, it is. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Shooting the brick. Yeah. You can pack wrap here. All right, we got a piece of concrete up there. Kind of blended in with all the other garbage, but. Wait, wait, wait. Still on the tree. I can't see it from back here. I think that's it. Oh. I got actually really scared the second I pulled the trigger because I just had flashbacks of the beam coming out. <laughs> I literally got scared. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what we got. Well, that was like uh, close to three and a half, four inch concrete block out of a floor, so that's pretty hard. And it completely, look at the purple or the gold paint there. That's awesome. <laughs> it's got more gold. It annihilated that block. There's, I mean, that's from before. Like it's completely, it's, it's gone. Gold everywhere. Everywhere. Just everywhere. Everywhere. It's completely, yeah, so my thoughts on the Bay Wolf, I love it, man. 
it is a lot of fun for the price point for 250 bucks for this thing and 200 dollars for ammo you, did you have fun today i had a blast i've had this much fun shooting in a long long time yeah i mean just and it worked good we had no hiccups at all and i mean it got covered in cock juice and everything <laughs> else so yeah well thanks for watching and if you have any other ideas what we can do with this let me know